Uh, I feel like we're gelling pretty good, man. Like we got a whole group of hard workers. Uh, it's it's evident when you look at the tape. You know, when we watch film together, walkthroughs, everybody's like t dialed in. Like you said, it carried over from the spring. Uh, we were on in the spring, came right back day one. Minimal errors, minimal MAs. I mean, it's, it's been great. I can't wait to really get it going to see how everything is at full speed. Kind of rookie tackle uh, over there, and, and uh, Alex Leatherwood, but he kind of carries himself not so much as a rookie. Uh, what do you, uh, your impressions been of uh, Leatherwood? I'm very impressed, man. He's super athletic. You know, that's off the gate. His mental, he's always working to improve something. Uh, he's always communicating with me on what he can do better, you know. Uh, sometimes I got to remind them that, you know, you don't have to know, you don't have to do everything. Everything ain't on you. You know, I'm here. I'm, I got you. I got your back. You know, we all got your back. So I, I really like him. He's a good guy. Is, uh, how, how fine is that line then between being excited for this fresh start with this fresh, you know, offensive line and being like, oh man, we really rebuilt this offensive line. I mean, it's <laughs> the way that the work ethic of these guys has been hard to even, you know, think about. What was, you know, we had some great guys here, of course, but, you know, we had guys like Andre. He learned from, he had the best tutor in the world in the NFL, I feel like. Andre's ready to go. You know, we got Richie coming back. Colton is more established. Colton has been, come a little dominant, you know, this past year. So, you know, we got some, uh, Alex came in, hit the ground running, you know, then I'm, I'm going to be a right guard and, you know, I'm always on my stuff. <laughs> but, yeah, I, I feel very confident in this group, man. We, I, I feel like we can, make, we can do some things, do some great things. How does it, was it, has it been strange to you that, like, you go from last year having such a veteran group along the line to suddenly it's basically you and Richie are, like, by far the veterans on this offensive line? I don't know, has that been strange for you? Uh, not really. It's a strange for me to step into the role, you know, as, you know, one of the vets in the room. <laughs> I look around and see everybody young and just full of energy, and I'm having to, you know, catch up to those guys. But... Uh, it's it, it hasn't been that much of an adjustment, you know. You got guy like Colton. He Colton may be in his fourth year, but he carries himself like he's a vet, you know. And uh, Dre, same way. And Coach, we got Coach Cable, and he's one of the greatest coaches, O line coaches in the NFL. So we got all the confidence in our in our own group. How was the free agency process for you? And when you came back here, were you thinking you were going to be a starter? That's what you came back and thinking it's your, your, your time to start? Oh, absolutely, man. Like, I, uh, I knew I had some big shoes to fill, you know. I, I played a starter role last year. Uh, coming into y this year, I kind of knew what to expect. Um, I, my, I mean, the Raiders were always my number one team. I didn't really expect to go anywhere else. I didn't want to go anywhere else. I love it here. And, um, yeah, I, I was looking forward to coming in and just – be, becoming more of a leader, you know, leadership role. Just I'm not a big talker in the locker room or on the field, but I kind of lead by example whenever I can. So I was really, really looking forward to that.